this is a little bit different than CAR T. These are TCRs. So CAR CAR therapy in general is where you have um, an engineered T cell targeting um, and expressing uh, antigen. This these antigens with TCRs are restricted through this HLA um, antigen complex. And, and um, cars are different in the sense that you know, for example, car nineteen, which is uh, CD nineteen, which are the is is probably the most common uh, car therapy right now that's approved in lymphoma, et cetera. Those are uh, kind of endogenously; exp- uh, those are uh, already expressed on on these tumor cells. With car, if you're thinking about uh, car T in solid tumors. Um, to date, we really haven't seen a whole lot of you know, activity in with CAR uh, directed therapies. For example, against HER2, et cetera. One of the the one of the challenges I think with CAR is is that you have something like HER uh, HER2 or some kind of EGFR uh, as a target with a CAR T cell. Um, the concern is is obviously these antigens are also expressed in normal tissue, and you can't really kind of just on and off switch off these T cells like you could with, you know, uh, um, a small molecule, et cetera. Um, TCRs are, are different in the sense that um, you have, uh, these are very uh, almost uh, specifically restricted to tumor um, um, cells, uh, the uh, cancer testing antigen uh, family, particularly MAJ4, MAJ10, AJ3, et cetera, they're very restricted to um, um, uh, tumor cells. They, they, they're almost, almost not expressed on any other uh, tissue outside of tumors. I think this whole field in solid tumor, obviously uh, cellular therapy in general is, is taking off in, in liquid tumors, particularly in lymphomas and certain uh, leukemias. I do think that in solid tumors, we'll, we will see, continue to see uh, development and improvement in how these cells are delivered, uh, how efficacious they are, and what subsets of tumor types. Um, you know, uh, I'm really excited about the Surpass 2 trial. I think that, again, the Sphere T cells of first generation may. Um, uh, may have uh, a role in a, in uh, a sarcoma in the near future. And uh, yeah, it's an exciting time.